2 of our Wanderlust Way starts again from Barnaby. We're going back to Hatcliffe to carry on where we left off last time. And the best part about that is going back through that one of the prettiest places I've ever seen in Hatcliffe with the becks on both sides of the road. Going through that gate in a minute. Bit of a back to where we was last time. Found some snowdrops. Back one side of Hatcliffe and the other. Gorgeous. Just having a pan round. Back to Hatcliffe. We're on our way to East Ravendale. There's a nice couple of monuments just outside of Hatcliffe. There's a bit of a log cut into a seat. And a poem from Anne Culver. It says, Come, fill the cup, and in the fire of spring, the winter garment of repentance fling. The bird of time has but a little way to fly and lull. The bird is on the wing. Very nice. As we head to west and east, Ravendale. A lot of bird noise walking through this section. A bit icy underfoot as well still. I think it'll be about four today at max. Don't find too many cliffs in Lincolnshire. Yeah, we just reached Ashby Cum Femby. Seeing as I've not done any of these footpaths in North East Lincolnshire, it's all new to me. The only problem is, I've left my sandwiches in the fridge. I even brought some flatjack last night from the garage, but I've left that in the car. Thankfully, this middle section is only eight miles long and not double, else I'll be struggling for some dinner. It says Brackenbury's of Bigsley, and 80 ice cream since 1833. We're going that way. Right in the distance at Waltham is a windmill. Not too far now to the finish of part two of this wander lust way. It's been another good day in northeast links. I think that's just a squirrel went across the track there, possibly. That's part two done. Catch us next time as we do the last leg.
the wanderlust way.